What's your favorite store? All right, my favorite store, I probably would have to say about probably like 7-Eleven. You know, I'd walk in there, you know, give me some cookies, you know, I'd fill up on all the packages, make sure I get the softest ones, you know. Cashier, they be looking at me crazy, but you know, I ain't really tripping because I got to get the softest cookies. You can take a girl in there, get her a Slurpee, you know what I'm saying? If your girl, if she don't mix at least two flavors into her Slurpee, she not the one, bro. Also, like, it's ketchup package, you know what I'm saying? Mustard package, run up in the air, grab you a bunch of them because I don't buy no condiments, bro, for the house, you feel me? Question two, celebrity crush. Celebrity crush. I'll probably say, probably Shane Lee Willie. You know what I'm saying? She's a baddie, bro. Secret Life of American Teenager, bro. Like, oh, damn, that chick. Man. You know what I'm <laughs> she's a white girl. She's bad, bro. Like, I was talking to the girl, you know what I'm saying, on the phone. She was like, what you doing? I was like, watching Secret Life of American Teenager. You know, she didn't think I had that in my repertoire, bro. So, but I do, you know what I'm saying? All right, anybody else? Oh, Joyful Drake from the uh from BET, let's stay together. She could use an EBT card for sure, like. Oh god. For sure. Damn, that's real. <laughs> Alright, damn. What's the worst you ever got rejected by a girl? Worst I ever got rejected. I'll probably say when I was on a bus, I was about 16. I was on, you know, the Metro 710 Crenshaw bus. You know, it was, it was a bad young ratchet. She was on the back, she was sitting by me. You know what I'm saying? I want to inquire about her services naturally. So, you know, you know, I tapped on her shirt, built up my confidence, tapped on her shirt. Man, she damn near cussed me out. She was like, why are you tapping me? I don't know you like this, this, and that. I'm like, damn. Everybody started looking to the back. They looking at us. I'm like, damn, like, I'm low-key embarrassed sliding down in my chair. Like, you know what I'm saying? I had to pull the string. And, like, that's my stop. It wasn't even my stop, but I had to get off the bus. So I was embarrassed, bro. I didn't even have a day pass that day, you know what I'm saying? I had to pay an extra 125 to be on the next bus, bro, but it's cool. Damn. All right, man, uh, next question. What you think you wanted to be when you grew up? Man, I ain't gonna lie, I thought I was going to the NBA, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, man, I was putting in work, you know what I'm saying? When I was younger at the YMCA, I'm averaging like 10 and five. I'm killing, bro. I'm out there dogging, you know what I'm saying? And the thing is, bro, like, it was eight minute quarters running clock. Every four minutes, you got to come out, because you know, Everybody had to play, so I'm averaging 10 points. I'm like, man, how can I not go to the league? You feel me? When we was little, like, you know, the kid with all the stuff on, yeah, he was the best. I was me out on the sleeve, the headband, and the J's. You feel me? So I thought I was going to the league, bro. For real. Dang. Last question. Bonus round. Who you do it for? Man, I ain't gonna lie. I used to do it for the Ratchets, but right now I do it for the girls with the good credit, bro. Straight up.